Ever seen a jet take off like a helicopter, hover in mid-air, then zip away at 600 Menedimadoners? That's the Harrier jump jet, a flying contradiction, and it somehow works. Born in the UK in the 1960s, the Harrier was the first operational jet capable of vertical takeoff and landing, aka VTOL. Originally made by Hawker Siddeley, and later upgraded into the AV-8B Harrier II by the US and UK. The secret sauce? Four vectored nozzles powered by the Rolls-Royce Pegasus engine, which let the jet thrust straight down or backward. Translation, it can take off from parking lots, carriers, or anywhere short enough to make an F-16 cry. The Harrier proved itself in the Falklands War, flying ground attack missions from makeshift carriers. It also served in Iraq, Afghanistan, and Bosnia, basically anywhere that needed a jet with helicopter moves and fighter punch. It wasn't perfect. Difficult to fly, expensive to maintain, and sometimes affectionately called the Widowmaker. But it inspired an entire generation of VTOL aircraft, including the modern F-35B. By the 2010s, most Harriers were retired, replaced by more advanced jets but nothing quite matches the raw, cool factor of seeing a fighter hover like a hummingbird and then roar away like a rocket. The Harrier, part jet, part helicopter, all legend. And yes, it can still out-parking lot your favorite fighter.